Hello everyone, Stuart from Stubu Gaming again for episode 2.4 of Inquisitor Martyr and by episode 2.4 that's my numbering system, not the games. We're currently on the last stage of finding the Magos Biologus and we've gone to the two loc well, three locations, so first of all the station, then the frozen wastes, then um, I don't know how you describe it, but basically a fungal planet, basically. Um, which would have been that one. I did, I was originally intending to do all of this in one single recording. However, um, I have had some friends come online, so I stopped recording. Um, and... Um, that's why we've now got some additional symbols in the top right hand corner because a cabal directive came through which uh, we've <laughs> I've obviously now uh, I can't, what's that saying in the background it says forbidden knowledge there we go so I can actually do that while I'm doing these uh, missions so we might see that I'm uh, picking up some of these things if the right sort of enemies are in the area should be interesting I'm gonna drop this back down actually because that was relatively difficult and I know this mission is difficult anyway yeah cause I had it on extreme but there's no difference between normal zero or ten glory. <laughs> Goes all the way up to plus sixty glory. Excellent. But between hard and extreme, it's the same value. It's ten percent, which is no doesn't make any sense. Put it back on normal. The only reason I've done that is because I have just been playing my ridiculously powerful assault class. So I don't want to end up getting myself killed because I run into things I shouldn't be running into. And as I said previously, I know that this one is actually more difficult than most. Sounds like warfare. Inquisitor, the rebellious forces of the Astra Militarium have taken over the area, and they're fighting with the loyal Imperial Guards. The rebels have surrounded the colony where the Magos Biologus might be holed up, and their mortars attack the Imperial fort with artillery fire. I've just walked straight into a war, haven't I? It seems like it. I'll take care of the rebel mortars first. Perish, Bill. 
probably have put it up in difficulty actually. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, I saw one set of bombs drop, that's it though. It's a big minefield. The chopper did reduce the difficulty. But I've had this on extreme. Death of me if I ain't careful. Good because I can't be bothered to walk all the way back to the beginning. How do you dare to turn our weapons against us? This is quite a big map, actually. chest. <laughs> Can only select it from one side. out before they fix the gun. Whoa. 
They remind me of Squiddies from the Matrix. I'm very dare they. strike I want to coordinate first with the Imperial Navy second mortar deactivated that will teach a lesson to this rabble an awesome kill streak just spinning on the spot killing everything actually speaking of killing stuff um, one thing that I did want to mention while I was playing with my friend we were doing a co-op mission and um, at different stages we both got uh, dropped so we both got killed it appears after the last update you cannot revive your friends in missions now it's obviously a bug they haven't removed the ability to kill uh, sorry to revive your friends because there is still a trophy or achievement tied to reviving friends 50 times so they couldn't have just removed it so I think it's a bug because of the targeting changes so I think they've made it impossible to target your friend lying on the floor um, which is obviously a very very big issue and I'm going to keep an eye on it to see whether it, well not whether but when it gets fixed because it's got to be fixed quickly these sorts of small niggling little issues are the type of problems that actually kill these types of games off I mean, there are some games that can withstand it, games like Ark for instance, they can withstand it because they're a new genre, um, or a relatively new genre, so they've got, they've got a lot more people who are willing to forgive because of the, the size and the complexity of the game. Games like this one can't because you do, especially on PC, you've got Diablo, you've got Path of Exile, um, there's at least two others currently in the works of being created so ARPGs really do have to be on top of their game and any problems that do occur they have to fix very very quickly because if they don't they'll end up killing themselves let alone uh, other games killing them off right let's just Disable this one, then go and get the uh, Magos Biologus. Sorry, I was just quickly checking the website to see if there was anything listed, but there isn't. I should probably have done that after, but uh, I thought I would do it uh, straight away so I didn't forget. If that was an attempt at sarcasm, you're wasting your time. 
Rest assured, the Conclave will be notified of your support. I've been looking for you for a while. I need your expertise. I am a high-ranking geneticist of the Machine God. My extraordinary skill set is undoubtedly best employed here. I have an Adeptus Astartes with grievous injuries on my ship, and I need him walking and talking. How often do you have the opportunity to work on one of the angels made flesh? This new information requires me to reconsider. I will accompany you, Inquisitor. <laughs> because I get to play around with a space marine, I'm going to abandon all of my attempts to solve a plague. Br brilliant. <laughs> oh, God. The mind boggles about why she actually said that, but never mind. Hopefully, as that was the last in the uh, mission, I've got something half decent. Uh, no, is the answer. Maybe a new inoculator. Great Axe inoculator. Belt item. Okay. Hmm. Skill point. Yeah, I used to use that belt item before on my melee character. A hey, investigation completed. Six hundred experience and fifty fate. Can't complain. Well, I'm going to sell this. That's going to be it. The only thing I need to do still is talk to the, the Magos Biologus, um, which I will do at the beginning of the next video in this series. Um, but, as always, if you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. I keep saying it, but please do comment, because it does help. It means I know exactly what you want to watch, um, and any improvements I can make, or whether you're liking the video or not. Um, so please as I say do comment make sure you hit the bell notification icon otherwise you're not going to be informed when I do upload new content and um, I look forward to seeing you for my next video which should be in the next couple of days thank you very much for watching guys and as always see you soon